Welcome to Let's Play Conquer's Bad Fur Day with your host, Dr. Tran. I am going to be Let's Playing this game, and it's going to be a good time. This is Conquer. He is the protagonist in our story. He can punch. Punch is like a wimp, I hate to say. And he can hiccup. Oh, look at that. He can hiccup. Look at that hiccup action. Hicking up it up. Whatever. And he is walking pretty slow. This is the entire game. This is the controls for the game. You hiccup and you punch. These will be very important later on. Trust me. This is going to be extremely important stuff. You can punch blades of grass, but it doesn't really do anything. I don't know why you would. Whatever lifts your boat, I guess. So, here we are, Conquer, and this is the Scarecrow. Let's see if we can go hit him. Oh, or if we can talk to him. Whatever. What's that, what's that? Hey, hey. Who? Who are you? Oh, hello. Can you help me? Ugh. Ugh. I, I need to get home and go to bed. I'm trying to talk over these cutscenes, well but sometimes <laughs> I might think of something to say, so oh. I'll say it. No. It's not too low, you can't no. hear them. You know, they're speech bubbles. Oh, you don't need the cutscenes anyway. Uh, uh, actually, yeah. Uh, yes, I can. Maybe. You know? Hey. Okay. I don't like? know why we need speech bubbles. Really? We're not deaf. Well, really? you're deaf, and this game is perfect for you. No. I love that line. Ready. Let's get birdies. Oh, hey, birdie. Um, so how you, can you help me? Right. Uh, let's step over here. And we can... I don't like the way he talked to me. So teach him a lesson there. Teach him a lesson to mess with Conquer. Here's a B. You see those buttons? Actually, you'll find that... Uh, uh, the current context says to me. <laughs> and, uh... Uh, well, actually, the, uh, uh, press B. Press B. Oh, yeah. The light comes on. Uh, and it makes this nice ting. Right, a ting noise. Nice ting. The rock ting. That noise. That's it. That's it? Yeah. That's it. Okay, I'll press eyes. B. Ugh, I'm gonna feel sorry for this guy. Don't drink, kids. This is what happens. This is a good this is a good game to teach you not to drink. But bad things will happen. Then again, what does that mean? Prologue says different. But that's another time, another place. It's sensitive to context. Try over there. Feck off, crows. That's very good. Well, you can try it again. Most people don't do this. I don't know why. I'm gonna show every cutscene. So. Don't do helium, kids. That's also bad for you. Well, actually, helium's okay. You can do helium. It's okay. Don't mind if I do. Very, very much. I don't know how I scare code I'm going to go to bed now. But... Hey, hey. I don't know how he talks either. And we can wake him up. Punch to the gut. And we can... Still have our amazing moves. Hiccup and punch. Yes. And here's the B button. We'll press B. Ding. <sighs> Can't tell you the amount of people would love to have that just button in their life. In fact, it would seem to me that these give me just what I need at that moment in time. Hmm. Oh, I see what he means. Context sensitive. Clever. Oh, yeah. I feel a little bad. Sensitive to the context <laughs> of which they are needed. Oh, and by the way, if for whatever reason you want to skip all these wonderful cutscenes, why do we want to do that, Conquer? But you will have to have watched them at least once. That's fair. Some games don't even let us have that. Oh my god, we can run! It's amazing! We can stop too! Oh, we can play baseball, we can jump and twirl. It's amazing! This game just got cooler. I thought it was good before that. It's getting better and better all the time. And we can swim all this time. Look at that swim action he has here. Oh, 
I can't seem to get any further. Oh no. I'm sure there was something. Ah yeah, now I remember. Hold the Z button down, and I should crack. Got it. Now then, what was it? Oh yeah. Press A to jump extra high. Then A again to do that funny helicopter tail thing. Now that makes me harbor. Hmm. Aubrey. I should easily get across that gap. Um, are you sure you got that? I'd have to be retarded not to, Conker. And now it's amazing. We can look around. That's cool. And we can fly. <laughs> Take that, Bowwinkle. Haha. Oh wait, that was the moose, wasn't it? Take that, Rocky. There's a door. Can't go into it. Conker still punches like a pansy. I don't know who taught him to punch. He needs to go to Taibo classes or something, because that is not acceptable in my book. Let's see, we can go talk to this guy. He looks friendly. Ah, who's this guy? If you think you're coming this way, you can think again. Oh, you're a real charm. I just want to get past you, please. No, I don't think so. I've only just got comfy. Have you ever sat on a piece of gothic architecture for 200 years? No, I It's right a glass, you know. Thought it was about time to move on to a bridge, say. And I'm not moving now. Isn't it a little bit early in the day to start talking about gothic architecture? Well, if you care to come a bit closer, we can discuss things of another nature. You know, I will. You know, I don't think you're very nice about this. And you know what? Oh my god, he's gonna hit me! Oh god! Ah! Oh! That is a rude gargoyle! Wow! That was not a nice thing to do. I was trying to have words with him, and instead of being a gentle gargoyle, he goes and throws me off of the bridge. How was that for friendly nature? Oh man. You know, I don't understand how he even got there. He has wings, but they're so small and he's so big. Why, you may ask, am I going to go fight this behemoth again? Well, I'm not. He is obviously overpowering me, and I cannot defeat him in my current state. Okay, Conker, come on, grab the ledge. We don't have time for that twirly, helicoptery stuff. Now, Conker can not beat him because he punches, as you've seen, like a pansy. So what are we going to do to fix that? I don't know. Well, this door open. Let's go check that out. Shall we? Yep, see? Punches like a pansy. All right, here we are in a room. What's in here? Oh, a key. Let's take it. Because a key is what we need to get out. Come back. Hang on. Something missing here. Didn't I have a... Ah. Nah. Try pressing B and see what that does. Okay, Gonk. Um, are you sure you've got that? Yes, quit asking me that. I bet you never ask me that again. Oh, a frying pan. Well, we can cook some bacon. Get this key. I have never gotten him in the first try. Hey, hold still. Things are looking up. Well, guess what, people? We got a frying pan. Yeah, you better run. We can go teach that gargoyle lesson now. He will rue the day he just threw me off a bridge and somehow did not kill me. Because if I got thrown off a bridge by a gargoyle, I tell you, trust me. I will not survive that. But Conker can. And now we got a frying pan. We are going to teach this man a lesson. Take that. A frying pan. <laughs> you stupid little. Uh. Oh, that got him off his ass, didn't it? That's got to hurt. Now we can go through that hole. Wow. How are we ever going to get through here? Well, let's see what's going on here. We could look around, but there's no time for that. Hey, a B-pad. 
let's check that out. Plunger with dynamite. Um, I think I know what's gonna happen now. Oh, oh. Yep, fantastic. Let's go and get some shut eye. Finally. Well, on that note, Conker will get his shut eye the next episode. Thank you, and good night. Tip your waitresses, I guess.